What's up, guys? Welcome back to this game. Uh, last thing left off, we were doing this. It was trying to activate with this door. However, I don't know if it's going to work. Let's find out. Um, I can't remember if there was some kind of puzzle or something with this game of how I get through. I don't know if I'm missing something. should be this door right here for some reason can't access it Go to the last checkpoint. I'll see if it maybe will fix it, but I'm not planning on it. I may have to just restart the whole level because uh, it's just not not doing the thing. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Yeah, I remember that part. 
Oh, so I was I was this okay, so I didn't like barely even did anything. Like stopped right here and then like just didn't do the thing. That creature stank of the worm. Endrin's decided to pull out all the stops. Yeah. Just a fucking bug. Should have known. I'll take care of it, Ava. Get your crew together and leave for Nevada. Find 80. That's the plan. Contact me on my terminal as soon as you're finished. Go. Oh, what the fuck? Wow, that was pretty intense. Don't really need to do this, but also. Ventilation, open, just a door, open. I know the more you disable of these, the more, like, you get, like, certain achievements for, so I wanted to actually just do that just for, you know, just to do it. Hold on. I'm supposed to be leaving, not entering. Just the right place then? I mean, I guess technically it goes down, so...
Wait a second. Well, I feel like a dumbass. Spirits of the Forest. Oh god. The hell are these things? Doggy mode, let's go. Woo! I just love how you just jump. Good combo though, just ground slam and then just throw the power. Only one way to destroy. Okay, okay, okay. at the right location, way over here. Peace, mode activate, let's go. Rip and tear, rip and tear, rip and tear. Oh, this guy's like a turbo guy. Good one. Alright, nice. Ethan, we're amazed to find 
But his strength will only hold out for so much longer. Make haste. The hell is this? Thing said lock when I clicked on it. What the hell? With this, I set you free. Return to Efen. I thank you, Fiana warrior. on the ebb, but its servants still live. Ready yourself. They are here. And they are waiting for you. <laughs> I can see. Well now, what do we have here? The mongrel that's been killing my men. <clears throat> Ms. Metal Arm. Show him what you can do. I mean, I guess. This is no place for bloodshed. Make the Umbra take you. Um. What? 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 Stay calm. This changes nothing. Collect his fucking head. I'm ready. You call yourself a soldier? It's your time! <laughs> We're just hitting all the guys behind her. <laughs> On two. Let's go. Fight. Ooh. I'm not afraid of you. What? Oh, damn it! No! no! <laughs> you're not afraid of me, but you're afraid of a fall to nothingness. I have no idea where I threw you. You could be in the void for all I know. The important part is, I didn't eat her, so I did good. I, I, I didn't. I didn't resort to bloodlust. You have freed this territory from the clutches of the worm, and the spirits are returning to the forest. Your fight for the cairn is over. Yet, in spite of your victories. Your spirit is troubled. I mean, everyone's gone. When I was fighting Tanker, 
Where exactly did you send us? Deep inside the Umbra, the spirit world. Oh, so she's actually in the void. You can <laughs> but the Umbra surface. I took you into its depths. It was the only way you could fight the servants of the worm without bringing harm to Gaia's domain. Those Endrin security members transformed into strange creatures. How did that happen? The worm has the worm. corrupted their bodies to mirror the twistedness of their souls. They are possessed by Bane's spirits of the worm. They become Fomori, the deformed creatures that you fought. You can use your penumbra vision to detect this corruption mm. and anticipate their change. Oh. We have lost our leader, and our pack is scattered. Even heavier on my heart, Endrin has taken my daughter. I felt the Silver Fang submit to his rage. Uh -huh. Then you may carry the burden for the rest of your life. You did what had to be done. Leave without fear, Kahal, and find your daughter. I will call the Garu back to this cairn and continue my endless vigil. You do you, Bubu. We shall meet again. Ava must have found Adi. She must have. Dog mode activate. Let's go. I'm assuming she's up here, but I could be wrong. Ava, the pumps are done. Tell me you found Adi. They've taken her to one of their sites in Nevada. Viridian State Prison. That's where they... I know. No time to lose. Don't worry, I've all... I love the cutscenes in this game. They're just so dramatic. Oh! I'm not going to take that sword. It would be really cool if I could, though. I'm sure there's a way I can. Why would they put it there if you can't take the sword? Gahal, Viridian State Prison is in Nevada. They've got a lot below the prison. That's where they're keeping Adana. So why I like the purpose personally got captured on purpose killer for years the Badlands butcher that's your new identity hmm. I've entered your description into their database get yourself it they'll throw you straight into Viridian state This feels a lot like Splinter Cell Double Agent. Kahal, so you finally turned up. Been waiting for you for a couple days now. I'm not Kahal on the Bad Spans Butcher. I take it Ava put you in here? Good to have another man on the inside. How is she? I don't know her too well, but it's clear all this is shaking her. She's putting everything she has. I can relate. Some of the prisoners might have info. Those with influence. The two most influential prisoners around here are Lon Shibeta and Seth... Uh, Seth. Shibeta's Mafia. And he's still running his business from the inside. I imagine he gets along well with the Warden. From what I hear, they're always trading favors. The other guy, Seth, he controls the drug trade around here. Might be worth a visit if you need a boost. You'll find him in the gym. He never leaves. Apparently he's sick with something. Who's in charge? That does not sound good. 
guy named Hadley. He's the one who gave you the sticky eyes when you walked in. That sticky eyes. All the way up to Warden. I've never heard that saying before. He's an engine man. He looks me real strange. Give me that sticky eyes. Starts. Oh, what? Speaking of, got it. Yep. Don't worry about me. Ava's got it all figured out. Good. Now lead me to the Shibeta. I'll start with him. I'm not looking for problems here, Butcher. Sure you are. Out of line, and you're dead. Ooh. It's a pretty blade. Look a lot better ringed around your neck. Just saying. That's your guy at the top of those stairs. If you need me after, I'll, I'll be, be done myself. with the program in a week. Then I'm out of here. Out and paid. If you told me two months ago that getting locked up would be the best thing that's ever happened to my finances. Hmm. What's up, boy? What are you doing here? Refresh me. The cord's occupied. Now, fuck off. He doesn't look sick. He looks like withdrawal sick. Not like sick with things anything wrong. Uh I heard you sell stuff that you can't find anywhere else. But where are The boss man himself, Lan Shibeta. You're in with that greasy motherfucker. I careful now, I'm not more new blood. Uppers. I can do that. And how That depends. What do you You've just come through the gates and you think that I'm the fucking Badlands butcher. Huh? Name it. Ah so you're the butcher. I've I've heard of you. But I've also heard you died in your home state. Where was that again? Uh, I don't remember what they said when we walked in. I wasn't paying attention. Colorado. Colorado. <laughs> the butchers are proud South Dakota. If you're the butcher, well, no, but shit. Don't want to deal with that. Now I know. So you know, I heard you said. Doesn't matter. Oh, Upper. I can do. That depends. You've I'm the. Uh, South Dakota, and the rumors of my death have been greatly exaggerated. The rumors of yours won't be if you keep fucking around. Whoa, Ooh, now, Butcher. I'm sorry, I didn't realize. <clears throat> Perhaps we can come to an agreement. I give you your fix, and if I got a problem with someone, you give me a hand. Not a bad deal, right? Damn, dude, you're know. seriously going through Perfect. trolls. I have my stuff stashed at the bleachers. Take whatever you like. Guys, uh, open the door for him. If you fucked me over, I'm calling back for this ass. Is that it? Really? Like a little bit of guy to get you uppers up. Try to do this smoothly. I'll be 
done with the program in a week. Then I'm out of here. Out and paid. If you you're Lon Shibeta. In the flesh. And you're the notorious Badlands Butcher. Welcome to Viridian State, my friend. To what do I owe the honor of your visit? I know that the Warden offers certain prisoners a deal. Prisoners like you. So, uh, you're looking to take advantage of the offer you- Fuck no. I just want to see where Endrin takes the prisoners who- You're very well informed, my friend. Well informed enough to know that nothing in this life is- I give you what you want in exchange for small- What can I do for you? You see? Two of my men think that the time has come for me to, uh, retire. A man can't advance in this world without possessing certain values. Ambition is one, of course, but so are prudence and loyalty. I take it these two men were neither prudent nor loyal. Yeah, you catch on quick, I like that. I'm gonna take the names are Neil Jordan and Eric Ross. What can you tell me about Neil Jordan? Neil has a job in the workshop during the day. Uh, do be careful when you take care of him, though. They watch that place like that. That said, all sorts of accidents can happen in a workshop. <laughs> Where can I find Eric Ross? Ah, Eric's in quarantine. Most of the prisoners that get the Endron treatment usually spend a few days thereafter. I hate to tell you, but unless you can find a way in, you'll have to wait until he comes out. Mm, I don't have time to wait. I'll take care of your man. Hey, Lon Chibetta is a man of his word. Better be. He tries Eric, and he tries Neil, get information about Jordan Ross. Hold on. Is there a map? No. Oh shit. <gasps> we got a hostile. Shit. That's a wrong fucking button. Good? Lon tell you not yet. Who's getting name Neil Jordan? Huh. The machine he was working on overloaded. It was just a bit of extra voltage, but it gave the guy third degree burns. The maintenance fixed up the machine and everything's how do I un there are some voltage controllers in the workshop. Apparently Eric Ro Ross. And that guy? He'll still. They don't exactly keep that should be all I need. If you need. All right. What's next? I him down. Have you seen what happens to the guys who agree? The stronger, sure. They think they love me. Should be getting some tomorrow, unless he ends up in the infirmary. Here, 
sure the machine won't go haywire again? I've double checked everything, you know. You're good to go. I even cut the main power supply and put you on a backup generator. Yeah. Neil Jordan. Won't be easy to take him out without being spotted. Dusk told me I could overload the machine. First, to open all those valves. Problem is, I don't know which one's which. Guard said the main power was cut. I can fix that. Oh. Whoops. Mm. They should be getting some tomorrow. Unless he ends up in the infirmary. He's not looking so hot right now. Oh. Okay. What's up? Apparently Eric Ross. And that guy? Still. That should be all if you... I was just fucking here. Shit.
Which one's this? Please, I'm burning. My insides are burning. I need to get into the infirmary. That's where I'll find my poison. Please, I'm burning. My insides are burning. Please, stop it. Give me something. Anything. You have to have pills or an injection or something. It helps me. Please. I turned him down. Have you seen what happens to the guys with me? The stronger, sure. Where did you put that last batch of drugs? I left everything on the table in the staff lounge. Seth wants us to send him everything before tomorrow, but the drugs still need some work. The dosage is too high. Right now, taking just one would put you six feet under. I've got to redo the dosages. Well, there goes our chances of an on-time delivery. Now we're talking. Good. Just need to slip one of these to dear old Ross. Shit. I don't see how it's not suspicious how the guy just keeps on going to these vents. <laughs> Eric Ross, got pills for you. Thank God. I was at the end of my rope. Were you? Nice. This will make it much easier. So, what news do you have for me, my friend? All the good news. No a problem. Now, for your part. Very good. Lon Chibetta is a man of his word. Take this pass. It'll get you into Hadley's office via the infirmary. To find a secret passage into the lab from there. Best of luck, Butcher. I get the feeling this is farewell. So do I, Lon. So do I.
<laughs> Why don't I just arm myself and just walk up there? Someone just bags plants? Who just does that? Documents. Can't even look at it. This is Hadley's office. Let's see. No. Found it. Laboratory. That's where they took Adana. Oh shit. Subjects four and seven are reacting badly to the treatment. Eric Ross. I have to find her as soon as I can. Who would have known? It's something we see often with heavy users of psychoactive drugs. Their cellular structures are weakened even before the treatment. So when we inject the serum, the metamorphosis is quicker and notably more painful this is where those monsters were developed I picked up your scent from down the corridor. You're like me, aren't you? Oh, yeah. Who are you? My name is Onawa. Onawa. I am the pack leader of the Red Talons. And who are you? Onawa. I've read Indrin's reports about you. My name is Kahal. You must be the Garu Endrin's testing on. How did you know that? I've read Endrin's reports. Testing is too kind a word. Any idea what they were trying to get out of you? Not really. Why are you here? Adana? Adana's your daughter. Had. Not anymore. Their tests on her bore fruit. They have taken her away to Endrin's. Take me with you. Good work. Now, follow me.
This door leads into an underground parking garage. How do you know, sir? Why is this so close to the exit? Why is the exit so close? To get to my can. There are guards. Mori. I can feel it. And I am in no state to help you. I've got to do it. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh damn. Rhino man. Got some presents for ya. <laughs> Yeah, it's an epic soundtrack, all right. Manoa, it's time to move. Come on, Manoa. I may have blown up the truck I was supposed to use. I apologize. Actually, never mind. <sighs> Let's go. Assassin Jack, welcome. I actually love the cutscenes in this, they're just so fucking pretty. So well detailed, so well drawn. This game should have got a lot more credit than it, it did. Like, this game is extremely under underrated. It reminds me a lot of uh, X-Men Origins Wolverine. How are we doing? 
Um, not gonna lie, I'm a little exhausted. I'm, uh, I'm tired, but, you know, I'm, uh, Tell me. making the best of it. I'm, uh, got new stuff. I got, uh, new product, actually, has been helping me out a little more. It's called, uh, Mud. It's, like, made with a ton of different things, too, uh, like herbs so? and mushrooms and, oh. um, chocolate what and a bunch of the things that are, like, naturally made. And ground up together, mix it with hot water, or in like a blend it up in things like a smoothie. It's fantastic. It's, it's like it replaces coffee, so it's my a lot healthier to ingest. Ava and her lambda mankind. But I'm doing good. I'm doing good. It's such a great detail. Like yeah, it's this game is so greatly detailed. I was surprised that like this was a. Uh, like a single or a double A title instead of the triple A titles because this game was like is normally the studio that makes this game usually makes visual novels or like um, top down like 2D games like they don't make games like this so when I saw that this studio made this game I didn't believe it at first because it's so phenomenally made it must have t took them like I don't know how many years probably to make this because they normally make visual novels, which is like, you don't know what those are, it's based like dating sim games. And, uh, yeah, the, the detail in this is absolutely phenomenal. So I don't know who helped make this game or make this game possible. I appreciate it. We are not to pack. Uh, those animals are not there. Humans are with us. They're fighting for Gaia. Humans are the reason we need to fight for Gaia. We should have snuffed them out at the dawn of their existence. Shit, man. On our side. And we have no intention of settling here. We'll leave as soon as we've managed to rescue my daughter from Endron HQ. So, you intend to fight, Endron? We could use your help. No. We have already lost too many. We okay. will not join you. However, I will clear your path. My wolves tell me they have already attacked your people. Yeah. Those attacks will end. Good. You may operate on our land with impunity. At least, until you finish your business here. Stay longer. I also like during cutscenes in this. Like you can show, you can move the camera angle whatever direction you want, which is something for a third-person game. They should totally take advantage of in other games, because like in other third-person games during cutscenes and like little conversations, you can't move the camera at all. Like it's not possible. Um, but in this one, you could move it in any direction you want and like take it from any angle, or, like pay attention to different certain details in it. And I think other games should totally take advantage of that. Hey, buddy. Looking kind of cute there, buddy. Um, bug? So, Ooh! Oh, yes, so this is your version of the spirit. Of human war. Well, it's it's almost like I'm covered in the blood of humans that I just viciously, cold-blooded murdered and ripped them from limb by limb. I fight for I fight for Gaia. I'm fighting for Gaia to drive Endrin and the Worm from this territory. Is that so, or are you pursuing an aim that is more personal? Why can't it be both? Great game. Uh, yeah, it's a very good game. I'm really impressed with the detail. See, just because it's personal, yeah, they took my daughter, but doesn't change the mission. It doesn't. Gaia, I, I still fight Gaia. Even though they took my daughter, yes, it's still my daughter. It's not like this is a strictly business thing. This whole fight for Gaia is a personal business. <laughs> you know? Gaia included. 
The mission can be both, a okay, personal and business. Admit that Gaia is a wild, uncontrollable entity. I don't know what this being is. It's like part hawk, part rattlesnake. This being is really cool, though. All right, they will never admit Gaia is was a wild, uncontrollable entity, and that is she demands sacrifice. He is wrong. He is full of darkness. Basically, this is saying they're both wrong. Um, I will prove to you that humans can accomplish great things for Gaia. You will only prove that you are as blind. And you can't see that the worm is already here. And that the humans that are with me have nothing to do with it. Such impertinence. The presence of the worm is not a concern. I what? Have battled it time and time again. If it's your main it's bad guy, you. humans aren't born with the worm. <laughs> You're a blind fucking deity, aren't you? Yes, you are. <laughs> fucking adorable. Oh, now has taken that role upon herself. Now go. I shall judge your worth. Judge my worth? What about all the other deities you talk to from time to time again? Ask any of your friends. I'm a perfect glory of Gaia. Oh, no. Alright, lead the Red Tail and Karen. Okay, skills are up. I can feel the hate that flows through her. And her guardian spirit. Oh, she's fucking angry. I mean, then again, wouldn't you, after being tortured for, like, days on end by humans, you'd be a little resentful towards humans? Hold up, wait, wait. Am I in Colorado, or is this, this is Utah? It looks like Utah, but I want to say it's Colorado. We're not in Kansas anymore. Ow! <laughs> Fucking love that. It's off in the distance, just wolves howling. Where's Ava? She's inside. It's good to see you again, Kahal. Thanks. Everything going okay? For now. We're staying on our toes, though. Hard wire tattoo. A Y wing. Well, technically, it's an X wing. An old abandoned mine. No. Crossbows. Endrin has been looking for Tarker's milk cairn for five years. How did you get out of prison? Ava just told me about Adana. I'm that so doesn't answer the question. We'll get her back. How did you get out of prison so fast? <laughs> Managed this game. He helped me. How did you manage to get out of prison? Pretty simple. Ava sent Viridian State a transfer order for me, complete with an Endron seal of approval. During the transfer, Lambda Mankind attacked my convoy. So she's not a prisoner? She's still, like, fully free? I'm just busting your balls, man. You were there to save your daughter, I get it. Besides, at the end of the day, I'm out of prison. Thank you for your help in the prison. You took big risks for me. You can thank me when we've got your daughter back, but just remember, my favorite way to be thanked is cold, hard cash. Lest I forget. Doesn't look like you're doing a lot of whole cold, hard cash, you, you know, there. out here. What are you gonna do? Spend it on rocks? Make some dirt? There's no food out here. There's no, like, source of entertainment. You're just been gambling it away. Because the currency is fucking useless out here. Ava said they're a different pack than the wolves at Tarker's Gaha. We're going to have to be careful. You're alone. I'm sorry, Ava. 
They'd already moved to Donna out of the prison by the time I got. This is another character I like quite a bit. Um, Do you know where they've taken her? She's so well he scaled the shininess of each of the character. Like the collarbone is subject. The neck you can see the jugular is perfect. Just the whole scale of this character is like absolutely just beautiful to look at. I don't even care if this, she's bald. Like even her eyes are so well detailed. It's amazing. She even has a lip ring that's like slightly noticeable. Her ear has even has like the character of this special earring that's like around there. That certain area bracelets like each character is like uniquely put together it's really cool rest <laughs> assured they won't attack you again i freed their leader from endrin's grip they captured another garu they were experimenting on her before they captured adana apparently my daughter makes a better test subject those fucking bastards <sighs> we'll save her i promise you Leader of the Red Talons agrees to hold back her wolves until we get Adi back. But she's not going to help? I think she's using us. We take the risks, she reaps the benefits. At least they'll leave us alone. I'll take it, but have you seen the wall that protects those Indran outposts? It's yeah. surrounded by a minefield. Nobody here can get through their defenses. That's you. not true. You can either A, dig underneath, or B, you can just, you know... Sweep them properly. She's a girl too. Uh, she has a plan. Only me. Need I remind you that you're a Garu too? Sure, mm -hmm. but I'm not a fighter. My strengths. Lie yeah, in what you need is in your brain. Stuff. You don't need to be a fighter. It's a minefield. You can't just brute force it. For a couple of days, it's called blowing off flesh. Activate their landmines and get you into an evac duct. It'd be too small for a human, of course. You're telling me an electromagnetic magnetic pulse of your capabilities isn't equivalent enough to get rid of that minefield? Guarding the terminals in each outpost and connect me. Once I'm on their network, I'll be able to clear you a path through the maintenance zone. It's the quickest way into Indran HQ. Go see Declan. He'll tell you how to get past the minefield. Or I can just walk through the minefield. Tell me everything of what kind of mine it is. Everything you know. <laughs> we'll get past it. Should I clean my room or not? Um, when's the last time you cleaned your room? That's what I want to know. Because <laughs> if you got some, like, fucking mold growing on the floor or some, like, wrappers, like... You know, personally, I, I'm not a big fan of any kind of clutter. I don't like clothes on the ground. I don't like anything around my feet. And uh, I don't like trash clutter. That's my kind of thing. Long as the floors, hey, you're here. nothing on the floor, you're fine. But, like, also, you got to make sure whatever workspace you're working in, I heard they took it's not, like, the dirty. Shield. If you got spilt shit everywhere, clean that up too, man. Might as well just do like a spring clean of your room. Just take all the trash, take all the dirty clothes, get it out of there. Not saying to make your bed, but like, you know, clean up the important parts. From that mark, go straight towards the wall. Once you've reached it, stay close. If you need to, section it. From there, it's all up to you. Good luck. Oh, if you got cups in your room, please bring those to the dishwasher or possibly, you know, the sink. <laughs> That's like the last thing you need is just like cups piling up in your room and then you find out and like, you know, going to get a drink or whatever and you don't have any more cups or anything to <laughs> just use. You don't want to be one of those people that's like drinking out of a fucking carton. This looks promising. I was wrong! <laughs> so, my bad. I had forgotten that I have a uh, werewolf sense. And I did not use it. Um, 
All right. That's weird. Why can't I see the werewolf? Why can't I see the mines? What? Oh, what's up, Rano? How you doing? Snipey snipey just coming in here just trying to show me what's what, right? <laughs> Can I just jump over this? <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, so they were they were serious about that. They did not want me to just cheat through the side of the wall. So what did this guy say specifically on how to get past it? What do you need? Remind me how to reach the evacuation dock. Go around the perimeter wall, but keep your distance. You'll see a huh. red mark on a rock. From that mark, go straight towards the wall. Once you've reached it, stay close. Follow the wall until you find the entrance to the duct. From there, it's all up to you. Good luck. Well, see, you pr the problem is, dude, um... I tried that, and then it didn't work. Um, so, I just got lied to. So I, I just, I just uh, figured out. Uh, she turned my room and I might clean my room as well. Um, see, last time I seen Raina's room, I uh, it was clean. Um, but I can't say that now. She is a teenager, and her room is probably riddled with clothes. Alright, <laughs> uh. <laughs> it's alright. It's all right. I was, I'm there too, like I, I have laundry and stuff to do, I'm not going to lie to you. But my desk, my desk where I work, my workspace, so this, this is fine. Um, I'm actually, I might be playing VR later too, posting through Facebook, but I'm not certain. Because uh, I have only like 30 minutes until I get ready and leave for work. Yeah. Why do you ask? Just curious. You wonder what that is. Press the button. You know this, right? I'll be back in a bit. I'm going to clean my room. Good boy. Clean your room, Jack. Be that little assassin where I want you to be. Clean room means a cleaner kill. <laughs> All right. All right, all right, all right. Dog mode, go. Have you played this yet, Rain? What's this? What's popping? Oh shit, man! What's up, man? Is that Mid East? The first time nah, I can't be. It's not Mid East. Who's this? What's popping? Just had surgery. So this game is is really fun. Normally it's a stealth game, but the thing is, this game is uh, very difficult, and I'm playing on also the highest difficulty. And I started the game, and I got too far in it. And I ended up, like, getting really stuck to a point where I couldn't do it anymore. And I didn't want to start the game over again. So I just kind of modded it. And, like, made it so stealth is a lot easier. Um, but during 
certain fight scenes I'll turn it off just to kind of challenge myself more. What am I supposed to do? Clean the outposts and hack the terminals. Because that was useless. Um. What? What's the point of this then? Wait a second. Oops. Rage mode. Wow, okay. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Grab. No, grab him. Grab. Execution. Okay. Oh, God. Frenzy energy, let's go. Oh, God. Come on. Rhino man, come on. There's so much blood in this. There we go. That 
That one's cleared. Ava, I've cleared out the outpost and connected you to the network. Good. I'll try to take control of Indra HQ's surveillance system. I've learned more about the Earth Blood Protocol. Oh, these are my dudes. Into their soldiers acts directly on their immune system. It seems like the experiment they've been conducting had to do with the protocol what too. To do with the guards who took prisoner? Shoot them, kill them, get rid of them. It's up to Declan and Ava. Don't need them. As soon as they arrive, we launch our attack on those activists. They fucked with us for long enough. I mean, this place is practically taken over. I don't know if you've heard the gunshots, but you know. <laughs> this was sent when we were attacking the fracking site. Little totem. Okay, okay, okay. Run, run, run. All right. Next, 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 next. Boop. 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 Slam their skull into the crown. Oh god, just ripped his throat out. Who's next? Oh yeah, they transform after they die, I forget about that. What the hell, he's invisible. Come on, you.
just launch them. Execution. Oh yeah. Ow. Okay. Well done. I'm almost through their defenses. Keep going. Endrin's headquarters has been pretty active lately. Seems like our attacks on their outposts haven't gone unnoticed. They're gonna bulk up their defenses. Oh, wrong way. I just like when I can turn into the dog whenever I want to. It's like one of my favorite features. <laughs> I want to go faster. <laughs> dog mode, go. Every hour, HQ's orders. I feel like I'm missing something. Aha, it's up here. I already turned it off, question mark. Oh god. Where this dude come from? Aw, I lost my combo. I was trying to go for a hundred. <laughs> 